Hello students, welcome back. This is the second lecture on the topic physical and chemical changes. What is a change? A change is the transition of any substance from one form to another. You can also define change as alteration in physical and chemical properties of matter which give a new shape and properties to it. Today, we will categorize the changes that take place in and around us. A change can be a natural change or a man-made change. It may be desirable by us or an undesirable change. Changes are also periodic and non-periodic changes, reversible and irreversible changes. Some changes are physical changes whereas others are chemical changes. Natural changes are those changes that occur in nature on its own. Examples of such changes are Beating of the heart, change in season, flowering of the plants, the sunrise taking place, falling down of rain, occurrence of earthquake or Growth and development of living creatures, all are natural changes. Man-made changes are a result of human activity. These changes can sometimes be useful to us and sometimes are harmful. Burning of fossil fuel, making of chapatis or formation of curd. All these are useful to us and these are man-made changes. Whereas students, changes like deforestation and water pollution are harmful changes. These changes have been brought about by man. Next, we come to periodic changes. Changes that repeat at regular intervals of time are called as periodic changes. The occurrence of day and night. The waxing and waning of the moon. You can see how the shape of the moon changes and it repeats after every 29 days. The movement of pendulum of a clock. When the bob is displaced from equilibrium position and then released, it begins its back and forth vibration about its equilibrium position. The motion is regular and repeating. This is also an example of periodic motion. The heart beats with a particular rate and its motion is repeated in a regular interval of time. So the motion of the heart is also a periodic change. The beating of the heart can be counted by taking your pulse. You yourself can try it. Count them. It is 70 heartbeats per minute under normal stable conditions. Change of season is a periodic change. Spring season is followed by summer season, autumn season and finally the winter season. Again, after winter we have the spring season. Non-periodic changes. Certain changes that do not repeat themselves at regular intervals of time are called as non-periodic changes. For example, freezing of water. The time required for freezing of water depends upon the temperature, how low the temperature is. Falling down of leaves is a non-periodic change. Earthquake. An earthquake is intense shaking of earth's surface. This occurs suddenly when the tectonic plates of the earth move. This brings about a lot of destruction on the surface of the earth. Landslides 
take place on the mountains it is caused generally during rain and there is movement of huge mass of rock coming down a slope it is very very dangerous and sometimes fatal points to ponder categorize the following into the different types of changes that we have done in today's video coughing breathing ripening of fruits cooking of food be careful children waiting to see you in the next online class with the correct answers till then bye